Hello my Yarnians! I have to video this for the second time because the first time it videoed in a small screen again, which I hate. Okay, so let's get started. Lisa's Crochet. Look what I made! I made a duster topper. Yep, what do you think of mine? I used my Red Heart Ombre. The stuff I had left, that's why her hair is a little bit more ooh, orange. I did have a stick here the first time, the first video I did. And of course, it did not video. There we go. La, 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 la. There it is. What do you think? This is a just super quick, super quick project if you guys want to make one. Terry at Yarnjoy, this is an easy one. I'll put the link down in the description below. I'm going to end up making a couple more. It's really great for getting the spider webs. Not that I have a whole lot of spider webs, but we all have spider webs. Okay, so let's get into the yarn haul. Okay, so I went to Michael's and I wanna make what is called a dinosaur out of my um, Amigurumi book that I had bought, the dragons. So I got these three colors of blue. This one is, and they're all the Lion Brand Impeccable. And this one is the Colorway Smoke. And it's really pretty. It's actually showing up what color it is there. And this one, I'm pretty sure was, yeah, Blue Moon. And there is, this is only $4.99 a ball. Oh God, you can't even see me. <laughs> Sorry guys. It's only $4.99 a ball, and uh, there is 285 yards. I love this stuff for Amor Groomy. I highly recommend it. You can get it at Michael's. This one is Sapphire. So I got the three blues, because I was originally gonna use these two together, but I don't know. Maybe I might switch to these two, or these two. Well, no, I guess either one of the two darker ones with the white. So anyways, then when I was in Michael's, I seen this. It's an impeccable. I think it's a newer one. I haven't seen it before, but it looks a lot like the Lion Brand jeans. And it's softer than the other. Even though it's impeccable, it's softer than the other one I just showed you. So I'm going to make a hat with this one. And this one is in the colorway Indigo. And there's 179 yards, and it's a medium four. And this was $4.99 as well. Then they had the Marley Bird Sheep and Sheep on sale for five something, which this is usually like $12.99 a ball. Um, it is 100% wool, that's probably why. It's a medium four. It's super duper squishy soft, like wow. Really, really nice yarn. What I bought it for is to dye. And the only reason I wouldn't have bought it if it was $12.99 to dye it, but because it was half off, I figured, uh, why not? So then I went to my dollar store because I was out the other day and wanted to buy some yarn because I had forgot the colors I wanted at home when I went out that day. <laughs> but anyways, this is Isaac Mizrahi Craft by Premier. Oh, there you go. And this is in the colorway. Oh, there's 328 yards in this, 300 meters, 100 grams, 90% acrylic, 5% polyamide, 5% metallic. Now that must be what these metallic flakes are in it. It's really nice. And that's mainly the reason why I bought it. It's not like a tinsel, it's, it's actually flex. Um, sorry, the colorway was ambassador paid three dollars for that this one was four dollars i got this at the dollar store as well it's called the fast track by lion brand it looks like it's a t-shirt yarn so i'm gonna work try working with this and making a basket and i'll let you know how that turns out and there is sorry there is 227 grams in this 149 yards super bulky six and the colorway is cruise ship aqua so there's that, and that is my little yarn haul. Now for my FOs. Yeah. 
I got some awesome echoes. Well, that was one I showed you right off the hop from Lisa's Crochet. Well, she's not the one who came up with it. That's just where she had done one and she linked the pattern down below. So I forgot the name of the girl who, who actually does it, but I will link her down below. Now this yarn, I had one from uh, Left is Right Crochet, Sandy. This is an um, alpaca, alpaca, sorry, alpaca and an acrylic blend. This is gorgeous yarn. This yarn, oh, this is a knitted hat. Sorry, Madonna, it is knitted. Um, I'm going to definitely make some more. And the pom-poms I got from Wish. And these are buttoned on. I have it buttoned on the top. I just put a button there on the top and then this just goes on top and it's got a little elastic that it comes off with so when you want to wash it your pom-pom doesn't get on ruined it still looks really good isn't that nice oh I love it and that was the yarn bee um Andy's alpaca oopsie and this was in the colorway Moonlit Mesa. Yeah. So I highly recommend that. I wish I lived in the States, but I'm in Canada and I can't get any more of that yarn. Thank God she sent me three balls and that only took maybe half of one. So <clears throat> then we'll move on to this ball of yarn. It was the Impeccable. Um, the colorway was Falling Leaves Variegated. And it was, again, the Lion Brand Impeccable. And here we go. Look how gorgeous that turned out. Look at the color in it. Isn't that amazing? I love it. So here's what this one looks like. This one was a little bit bigger than the other one. But isn't that gorgeous, you guys? And it's got the same button on the top, too. So you can take it off when you want to wash it. So, yeah, isn't that gorgeous? Then that's knitted up. Sorry, sorry, Madonna. Sorry, Madonna, they're knitted. <laughs> so anyways, okay, for my last FO, I got this. Oh, a little bit of a... This is called The Hiding Tree by Sharon Ohala. Isn't it cute? And this is the little squirrel that lives in it. <laughs> So you can put him inside. Um, it opens up here at the top. And he can just poke right on in there. And you close this up. And he's safe in his home in there, in the tree. Now there is a couple more little animals that go with it that I will end up making. There's a little bird that sits up here, or a little owl, and a couple other little friends, forest friends. And I am going to end up making them all. But isn't this great? Look at this. I just absolutely loved it. It was it was fun and honestly it was pretty quick and easy. It wasn't really that hard at all. I know it might look like it, but it wasn't. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's all I've got for you. Oh no, one more FO. I made this. This I made myself. I just winged it. Um probably shouldn't have put three buttons in the top of the head is probably too much I probably could have just went with two just messing around but anyways I made it with oh where did that yarn go right here the boh the bohemian Patton's bohemian in the colorway hot stuff hot stuff baby tonight yeah so there we go now I'm going to fix this a bit. I'm not going to go as thick as what I did. I'm going to take a row out. And this was half double crochet. And I just kind of, you know, started like this, went bigger, and then smaller again. I'm putting some buttons on the top. But it is cute. I don't know what it looks like on me at all. never did try it on. It's probably too big to, uh... oh, look at that. So there, that's what that looks like. It's actually really comfortable. <laughs> I have to admit, wow. Maybe I won't take a row out of it. I don't know, I kind of quite like that. 
But anyways, so this is a pattern that I, I don't know about the three buttons on the front. I might still go to two. But anyways, yeah. So if you want me to do a tutorial on this, let me know. Anyways, ooh, that's really warm and soft. I really like that now when I put it on. Okay, so thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for subscribing. I forgot to mention I'm wearing my bag o' dead. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Um, don't forget to hit the like button and the bell if you want to see more videos. I always have lots of FOs. Um, yeah, so until next time, see you then. Bye, guys.